Morning everybody. Morning. Another nice one as well. Yeah. Yes, definitely. Uh, yeah. Oh, sorry. You've brought your little brown book down, have you? No, not I've got, no, 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 no messages. No messages. No. Not to... In fact, it's gone quiet. Has it? I suppose people are starting to think about going off out of themselves. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Who knows? Mm. Emma contacted me about me uh, link to the raffle site. Because it's in the description below and people are saying it's it's not obvious where it is. She says you can pin it. I, I had a look, Emma, and I can't find anywhere, anywhere that allows you to pin them mm. links to, to the description at the top. But what I have discovered is the cards. I can put a link on the cards and put it up there and that's where oh got a little hair <laughs> <laughs> put it there um so that's what I've I've done the other other videos since I put the drawing on the raffle so now you just click on the link right there and um and it will take you straight to a raffle see whether it's 96, I think. Mm -hmm. Still, there's four days left. Mm -mm. Right. Right, that's, that's that. Um, I did some more work on, on the drawing that I'm working on yesterday afternoon. Um, I'll put that up after this. And that's that's it for me. That's what you've done. Yeah. Tracy's uh, gone in to see the consultant this morning. I think she's going to get the results of the scan. All oh, right. Um, I'm assuming that's what it is mm, about. I don't know. Well, Just that's... follow up. Yeah. Like said. Yeah. So... They, they don't tell you things, do they? they when she rang up, she, um, <laughs> she rang and um, the secretary said, um, did you book a... Uh, Follow up from you know consultation. She says I didn't know I had to. He said it'd be three week. Three days. Th three days for mm. three. Oh, I don't know. You should um, get the results in three days. And the surgeon were telling us you needed to ring up. Right. And the consultant secretary said that she should have made a follow-up appointment, but nobody told us she had to do this. They're all so vague, aren't they? They don't... Blimey, um, ...inform you of things that, yeah. that are important. Processes that you need to follow. Yeah. They just assume you that know. you know. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, that's where she is this... She's been this morning. Mm. Actually, now she'll be sat in a, a room... Having an interview for the job to, to do the doing. job that she's already doing. <laughs> yeah, oh. weird. The world's gone mad. Mad. Yeah. Mm. Um, so, and then she's working till uh, half three or something, four o'clock, and she's got to take a leaf here for a some alteration. Fitting, fitting for a, for a, this prom dress. To see if it's right. <laughs> it's all dash, 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 isn't it? Okay. Oh, and we've got a mouse. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this good the little mouse. In the kitchen. Apparently they'd been one while we were away and they'd got rid of it. They'd managed to catch it. But this one popped out last night. Did they just leave, yeah. take it out there? And release it. Yeah. Well, it'll just come back in. Well, that's what I said. Is it the same one? But Tris Alethea said it seemed lighter. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I said. Did you just release it in that garden? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh. 
It'll have just found its way to the same hole, won't yeah. it, where it got in. Of course it will, yeah. Or it's yeah. told its friends. <laughs> yeah, yeah, more likely. How uh, um, oh, we're going to catch that, I don't know. No, I don't know about catching it, but it's not my house. No. I know what I'd do. <laughs> Piece of lead between its earlobes. Yeah. <laughs> Letter 50. Oh. 10th of January 1976. It says 1916 there. Oh. You must have been a bit dopey at that day. <laughs> Uh, and this is um, from you. All oh, right. From you to me on the 10th of January 1976. 66. Six. That is totally wrong. What am I doing? It's 67. Yeah. That should be 1967. Are you silly, Billy? I don't think your Stanley is a square. <laughs> Carol and I like him. Carol thinks he will make a perfect boyfriend for some girl, and so do I. She also thinks you are handsome, mature and kind to me, which you oh. are. Oh. I put here, our kid and I never got on very well when we were young. He was more sober and responsible. He used to go to organ recitals and things like that. Um, we were complete opposites, mm -hmm. but it's not, that's not the case now. Now we get on quite well. Mm. Yeah, we, we are still totally opposite. Yeah. yeah. Um, I don't think Mum will let me stay off school. You see, I only have to stay off one and a half, one half day now, and they send someone round to see why. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Naughty girl. They've got your, the beady eyes on you. Yeah, they've got me mat. Yeah. If you are home on the 13th, you can come and pick me up at school one day. <laughs> you know, I would not let my mother part us. Mm. I am glad you don't blame me entirely, because it was from one of your letters that she read. I am having to lock my letters up when I have read them. I am only sorry I didn't do it before. You will never guess what happened to me today. One of the boys in our class asked me to go out with him. So I said I had a boyfriend in the army and that you were 19. He then said to one of his mates, tell her I will do anything for her. So I said, so will the boy I am going with. <laughs> then he said, T tell her I love her. And I said, I have heard that before. <laughs> then he said, why don't you come to a sex orgy with me? Oh, wow. I said, I can also have one of those with my boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, fruity. <laughs> Snuck through. And he is more mature, just the way I like him. <laughs> then he let it drop. <laughs> it's been a good day today. Two lessons of English, two lessons of science, then needlework all afternoon. I am making a dress. I have put a piece of material in the envelope. When I got home this evening, <clears throat> Mum and Dad were having a row, as usual. Mum said he showed her up. She has packed his bags and he is going on Friday. <clears throat> but she might change her mind by then, because without his money, she will only have what she works for. So we are going to be in a poor state. The time is 11.40pm. And we are all in bed, so I better say good night so a man can get some sleep. So take care and don't forget I love you very much and always will. Oh, I have just remembered something. My mum said she would not trust you 
as when you are drunk you'll do things you don't know about. <laughs> but I do trust you, or else I would not love you like I do. So don't let me down, will you? Lots of love from Pat to the best boy in the world. I love you. <laughs> There well, you go. Can't say. I probably did let you down. I don't know. Once or twice. I don't know. It doesn't matter, does it? When I got <laughs> drunk. Um, you know what better to do. Out there with a load of men that were all drinking as well. So you just go with the flow. Right, um, well, that well. <laughs> bit of a fruity letter. Bit of a fruity letter as well as... I don't know which boy it was in class. No idea. Yeah, they were all after you, lass. I know, yeah. yeah. It just sound as though we're a bit of a flirty flirt, doesn't it? And <laughs> all these boys chasing me. Well I remember in one of your letters, you were you were going to hospital. I think it was to see your mum. Yeah. And um, you got off at bus and you were walking to hospital, and somebody pulled up a, in a car alongside you, and um, or what? Or somebody following you or something? And you, somebody intervened. Oh. Um, a couple. Right. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Well, you mm. never know. There were there were a lot of things going on, weren't there? I mean, a lot of it you didn't know about then. It was all kept under wraps because you you didn't have as much communication out there, did you? No. No. This none of this Amber Alert and no. different things that they have now. Yeah. Yeah, the I remember you went on the bus to see your grandma in that same area. Funny enough, wasn't it? Where, where it Chapel Town area, and somebody attacked the driver oh, on yeah. the bus, mm. and the police. Um, you you witnessed it, and the police put you in the police car and asked you to drive, to round. drive round and see if you could identify who it was. Yeah, never saw him. No. No. Yeah. Wherever they'd gone. They gave poor bus driver a right kicking. Yeah, they kicked him, didn't they? Mm. I think that well, maybe we're around about then that they started putting this perspex stuff. Mm. So that front. they're like sealed in now. Yeah. 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 You can't get yeah. at them. Whereas before it just used to be a little door, didn't it? Across and I know when my dad when he got he got a job at um, at the market in Leeds, and it no sooner had he got this job than it the market burnt down. He didn't have very much luck, did he? Can you believe that? Yeah. And that market hundred hundreds of years old, yeah. and it burnt down because my dad got this job, and he finished up having to go on buses, <coughs> and he he didn't like it. He, no. it I think he was nervous. On, uh, on summer shifts, night time. Well, you got drunks, didn't you? And there were no cameras there. I think they've got cameras in them now, haven't they? That they are. They record things. And... Yeah, yeah, they do. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So, Graham and Wendy went home yesterday. Oh, did they? Yeah. Right. Um, they've had some nice weather while they've been no, away, no, I reckon. They have, they? they've been like they've this. sat out all the time. No. They like sitting out. Yeah. Yeah. Um, today... Ain't doing much. Drawing. Mm. We don't go... We don't go out much when we're at Tracy's. No. Tend to want to save. I don't want to be using fuel while we're mm. um, while we're here. Um, 
Um, so I don't go, I don't go around much. Uh -huh. We've only a few days, and then we'll be off. Mm. Yeah. We're not meeting up with Stanley and Jane because they've had grandchildren quite no. a lot, and um, the worn out. The worn out. <laughs> The so that we're going to meet up after we come back, aren't we? Mm. We need to rest a bit. Difficult. they're in the late 70s, aren't they? Aye. Well, it's difficult to me. He's 15 months older than me. Mm. And Jane's the same age as you, isn't Yeah, she? I think she is, yeah. Um, she might be a year older. It's weird, that. Because when we got married, they all thought you were so young. Yeah. And yet you were only a, a year younger than Jane. Well, J they didn't get married straight away, no, did they? No, they didn't, they, no. I think Jane was older when they got married. They, they just started courting when we yeah, got well, married. Yeah, when we got married, yeah, that week. Yeah. <coughs> it's hard to meet up with our kid because where they live, they live in, in a, a little box on an estate. <laughs> Mustn't offend anyone. Um, and there's nowhere to park. No. The, you no, because the, the, it's strangely to, to, tucked tower. away. It's tucked away is their house, round the back of another house. And then there's another house attached to it. It's a semi. And their, their, dry, their garage and driveways outside that house here, but it's... It's right, uh, quite a tight turn, isn't oh, it? You can't explain it. It's, yeah. It's toy town. Yeah, and then there's two other garages that belong to someone else, cause it's, so you can't park there. They just crammed as many houses yeah. into space as they could. And there's certainly no room for a camper. No. Um, I think we got the little camper in there. When I we think had the, we did, yeah. The little camper van, we got that in there. But definitely not this. I think group. Jane... Put her car in, or oh, Stanley put his car in garage, and then one of them. Well, parked, they used they to two, have, when our kid worked here, yeah, they two had two cars, cars didn't they? Mm. But they only have one now. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. yeah. There, there is a little parking space on the main road. Yeah. That we haven't tried. I know. Um, it's where people park. To, mm. to go for walks, I think. I but think so. We haven't tried it, so no. we don't know whether we'd fit in or whether there'd be space when you arrived or what. Mm. So, I don't know. Uh, we used to go to a little campsite there, but that was when we were in the other... Camping and camping. Caravan Club. Yeah. It's a Camping and Caravan Club CL. Mm. Um, mm. So it was nearer for Stanley to come and pick us up to take us to their yeah, house, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah. I'll go out with them. Yeah. Hmm. So, never mind. There right, we go. I won't bore you any longer. No. We'll end this video here. Sorry I haven't got anything more juicy for you. <laughs> <laughs> See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.